Coaching makes Salvas to Noble. Masters. Today, we're going to take a look at the top 10 snow movies. Oh, I love snow. Me too. I'm on it, kid. So anyways, let's enjoy the video, shall we? I guess I'm really not that too. Let's begin. Here we go. This was coming. <laughs> Guys, we're oh, snowed in here. And today we're counting down. But here it goes. Snow movies. It's not gonna be just snow. It's, it's gonna Did be I ever get a snow for this in April? In which snow plays a well, it looks like the, the winter is snow over, but it's really, are, really late about that were, snow. How popular they are. Films that only have some scenes involving snow, such as Inception, The Shining, and Star yep. Wars Episode Five. Yeah, and right. these fact, movies don't qualify are a little bit list. snowed in. Right, I'll see you shortly. Go get it. And sorry, no Christmas movies. We've already covered those bases. So whatever happens, stay the calm. Long nope. Sense. No Christmas movies Number anyway. 10, the day after tomorrow. You can't make it to New York. I've walked that path How seriously does? Enjoy the beautiful look of newly fallen snow. That's a lot of weather to do windy. that. But a global Very mistake, reason. Not as much. The in the future, will last seven to ten days. When it's over, ice and snow will cover the entire northern hemisphere. That's the predicament that father and son Jack Ooh, and Sam Ooh, that's really snowed out. Jake Gyllenhaal find themselves in after getting caught in some fierce weather patterns triggered by global warming. Yep, the weather's so gonna be global bit. warming, and it's we a snowstorm too. Supplies, really? It's risk. Yeah, an unnecessary risk. As we watch massive snowstorms with centers that hold temperatures below 100 degrees Celsius sweep the nation and New York. Man, that's Antarctica. even cold. We can't help but cheer for the and I know about that. Europe is buried under 15 feet of snow. Did I get a notice that I love that snow? But I mean, I don't think it's going to make it. I think slowly a snowstorm. I'm just saying, how do we know it's an ice age? Because of all the ice. <laughs> Who knew that a CGI comedy adventure set Ice, in the Age? Ice Age would be That's so much fun. no doubt. For the Ice Age. With Ray Romano, That's Dave a lot of dildos. Starring How could you own that? Mammoth, Sabretooth Cat, and Ooh, Sloth. Ooh, that's really good and sameable. They have discovered back to its tribe. We should return him. Let's get something straight here, okay? There is no we. There never was a we. Nominated for an Oscar for Best Animated Feature, this family movie set in a barren yep. wasteland brings Still got the best movie and I ever got. Story that set off Man, it's chilling out in here. Oh. You know what I could go for? Global warming. Number eight, Frozen. It's freaking cold up here! No, not the Disney movie of the same name. When three friends decide to take one last <laughs> Ooh, that's a 2010 film. <laughs> really? That's not a reason to talk about. This below freezing weather. This movie came out in 2010. Oh. What? It's not 2013. I know. Ashmore and Emma Bell as the unfortunate captives. Frozen sees them battling the freezing cold. Frostbite, yeah, have it's chilling out. It's a cold age thing. Telling you. Back in New they're, they're, they're just, they're pussies, man. The wolves around here, they're not even that big. Culminating in a film so suspenseful that multiple... Man, that's even chill out. From Go get it. it. If we stay up here, we're going to freeze to death and he's going to die. <sighs> what director Adam Green presents is a nail-biting thriller that keeps your heart pounding. Yeah, that we're heart's a little bit pounding, we're would you? That's a little bit pounding. 30 Days of Night. <sighs> Man, that's even thriller. <sighs> In this horror, based on a comic book miniseries, Josh Hartnett leads the cast as the weary sheriff of a small Alaskan town that enters into 30 days of sunless days and nights at the same Ooh, time that's as they really are cold. by a horde of vampires. Give me a reason that I'm gonna freeze weather. out. That's death approaching. 
As the town bands together to survive the onslaught of horrifying creatures, led by a convincing Danny Houston, the bitterly cold snowscape does much to add to the film's dread. Pretty much. That's chilling. That's horrifying their mom. Evil acting, along with stellar cinematography, makes this a must-see for fans of the horror genre. We have two advantages. We know this town. And we know the cold. Number six, Frozen. Ah, uh, that's what I'm talking about. No. A Frozen. Okay, here's the Disney movie. When a princess with the ability yep. to turn anything into that's ice Disney and movie snow when I'm talking about. the kingdom in unending winter and subsequently runs away, the queen has cast I'm all up. Her strange I'm a snowman. An unlikely group of companions must embark on a journey to find her and save their people. Oh, what a waste of that time. There's Anna, Elsa, Kristoff, and Savan, and Olive. Fjords and white Still sand. different. A lot more entertaining and lighthearted than the previous Frozen on our list, this Oscar-winning animated romp contains everything we'd come to love about Disney. Let it go, let it this go, movie's Let It Go. Still get that ice creative. Memorable songs, lovable characters, stunning visuals, and a good mix of humor and pathos. How about yellow? No, not yellow. Oh, that's yellow me. Snow. Of course it's you. <laughs> What about that? Number five, Cliffhanger. Yep, that's still ice and snow. Plane heist. You thought of everything, didn't you? Still so everything I know. The muscular mountain climber who must stop him and a stake of a hundred million dollars cash. Still stopping him, I know. That's chill, wow. Man, I know Cliffhangers are gonna be in movies, but that's really hot. Mix that in with epic slow motion, a critically acclaimed soundtrack by Trevor Jones, and death-defying action sequences and stunts. That's you a cliffhanger. Only... You're falling out. That's really shocked. Set precariously in the beautiful but deadly Rocky Mountains, this is one action movie you won't want to miss. Number four, The Grey. This is real. Set in the unforgiving wilderness of the far north. This that still is a little bit chilly. <sighs> still <laughs> wintry. A marksman hired by an oil company How do you know about that? Which is a task that'll come in handy when their plane crashes somewhere in the Alaskan wilderness. Are you serious? That's real. Be cool. Talk it's about that, would you? A way to safety. Otway leads the gang in a desperate bid for survival as they ward off the unrelenting elements and ravenous wolves. The wolves were scared of I didn't know about that. Near their but how about some chilling movies on this time? The best movies of how do you know about that? Fans of the genre. Wolves are the only animal that was secret man. I, I don't want to hear any more about the fucking wolves. Huh? Number three, Fargo. From his footprint, he looks like a big fella. A mix of black comedy and crime drama. This critically acclaimed Coen Brothers movie, Man, that was the really... northern states of the U.S., won multiple awards, including a few Oscars and a BAFTA. Yeah, that's yeah. cold. Yeah. You know what they say. The pregnant Marge Gunderson, played by Frances McDormand, is a shrewd police chief who must investigate a series of murders, leading her to a bungled kidnapping plot and a lot more oh. than she bargained for. I didn't know about that. It's just morning sickness. Come on. That's still in the snow and snow. Well, that passed. Yeah. Yeah, no, but everybody's like talking about that movie. It's fantastic acting, a well-written script. But still acting, story. I know. The snowy scenery that graces the running time of this classic does Oh, everything's a little bit working. And here you are. This is still. And it's a beautiful day. This is a movie when I ever see that. Number two, Alive. Oh, this is horrible. All right. Judge, all right. All right. When a Uruguayan rugby team's plane crashes into the Andes <laughs> Mountains in 1972, Alive, huh? spent more than two months battling that injuries, is a killer movie. and despair. Anybody with Nobody just on, on, on that airplane's coming through. Lay it in the snow. It'll help the swelling go down. That's Narrated by John Malkovich and with a stellar cast led by an enthralling Ethan Hawke, this survival drama is their incredible and shocking story. No. Yep, everything's a little bit gone. How do you first heard that? Still a little bit engageable, isn't it? I'm a bird. Nobody knows. The anguish along with the metaphysical themes and the triumph of the human spirit. This is one movie that'll make you wonder how far would you go to survive? How much further is it? We've been walking a long time. I've been a little bit walking. I don't have any strength, you know. He's still a little bit sick. I'm weak. 
still got snowed up. up. Before we clear the snow off of our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Lord, I will never Dream catcher. <laughs> The girl with the dragon tattoo. You'll be home tonight, if that's what you wish. Aren't the Johns the fast runner? I cannot jerk you see me. Get your snow boots on. Hot tub time machine. Anybody want to go for a little sleigh ride? Welcome to the Out Resort cold. Family. There's no business like snow business. Doctors in Vega. Number one, the thing. First goddamn. Yep, winner. the thing is the Directed number one on that list. John Carpenter. This cult sci-fi horror has become a classic, and it's even that's a little bit science fiction, isn't it? When this thing attacked our dogs, it that thing's a little them. bit monstrous. Absorb them. Starring Kurt Russell as McGreedy. The unofficial leader of a group of researchers at a remote mm. Antarctic research station. The film well, that's the number one on the list. Bring it back. The base with the ability Olaf, to you're just chilling. You kidding of going me? Crashes when this thing gets thrown out or crawls out and it ends up freezing in the ice. Who is real and who is an imitation is the main source of terror. Still is a little bit realistic. What do you know about that? Special effects. It's a thing. Do you agree with our list? Well, and that's about it. See you next time. Oh, it's over. Well, guys, thanks for watching. Bye bye. Well, that's it, folks. Bye bye.